Northrop Grumman offering YF-23 for Japanese stealth fighter project. Japan is also seeking offers from Boeing and B-Systems as it searches for a foreign partners to help and speed up the program along. At the same time, Northrop Grumman has reportedly held talks with Japanese officials about joining that country's stealth fighter project. Reuters was first to reveal that Northrop Grumman was actively eyeing a spot in the Japanese program on July 2018. Japan has been looking to develop its own fifth generation fighter for more than a decade after the US government blocked foreign sales of Lockheed Martin's F-22 Raptor. Northrop is interested. The Virginia headquartered defense contractor has already held meetings with Japanese officials to outline the types of technology it could contribute to the stealth fighter program, but has not made a proposal based around a particular aircraft type. The last time the firm publicly developed a manned stealth fighter was in the 1980s when it pitted its YF-23 Black Widow, which built upon its previous experience in low observable designs, against the F-22 in the U.S. Air Force's advanced tactical fighter competition. Though the Raptor won that contract, the Northrop has since gone on to develop a number of other manned and unmanned stealth aircraft designs including the B-21 bomber. Northrop Grumman offer is likely to be immediately in steep competition with Lockheed Martin, which have already included a concept that reportedly includes design features from both the F-22 and the F-35 hybrid. The Maryland headquartered defense contractor also already has experience working with Japan on an earlier fourth-generation fighter project. A Japanese partnership with either company could leverage existing technology to keep development costs, pegged at around $40 billion, as low as possible, as well as provide a vehicle for important technology transfer to domestic companies. So, though Japan is eager to court foreign partners for the stealth fighter program, it has made clear that domestic industrial cooperation will still be a core part of the effort. Japanese officials have made it clear that the final aircraft will include avionics and mission systems, a radar, communications gear, navigation equipment, and even engines from the country's Ehe Corporation conglomerate. Mitsubishi Heavy Industries will have to be involved in a significant portion of the physical production of the aircraft. In 2016, this company put its own fighter demonstrator, the X-2, stealth fighter into the air for the first time. And according to Reuters, the F-3 competition might not be limited to just Lockheed Martin and Northrop Grumman. Japan is still hoping to hear back from Boeing and British defense giant B systems. Japanese officials have worked closely with Boeing in the past on domestic production of the F-15J Eagle. But despite the flurry of activity, Japanese officials have yet to publicly outline a clear plan for when the development of the stealth fighter will even begin. Previous schedules had the project beginning. This might make an offer from B Systems, or another European competitor, attractive to Japan. France and Germany, for example, are working together on their own stealth fighter project. Maybe B Systems could join the program at a later date. He also showed a video with a prospective tale as sixth generation fighter concept for the Franco German program. At the same time, the Japanese stealth fighter project will also be up against competing priorities within the country's own defense budget, and Japan has been facing increasing challenges from both China and Russia over a number of territorial disputes. Japanese jets routinely scramble to intercept Chinese and Russian planes near the contested Senkaku and Ural Islands chains. To meet these and other security demands, Japan is still hopeful it can get an F-3 stealth fighter into service by the mid-2030s. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe.